Hey, what's good? It's your boy Too Clean over here at Afro's and Hookah. Welcome back to my channel. And uh, I'm sorry, I'm gonna have to take a a little bit of a sippy sip for this one because we got some brothers out here trying to make us look bad. So not so fresh has been exposed one more again. And I truly believe that this guy is a gift that keeps on giving because he is always getting exposed and I like watching it because he's getting his due diligence. You know what I'm saying? He talks so much mess about how black women ain't this and the fellas need to go overseas, you know, get our passports and, you know, pretty much get with all the exotical women out there, you know, and just leave the the westernized quote unquote women alone. You know what I'm saying? Go overseas because uh, over, they have wives over there. They have, you know, what we're looking for over there. You know, just downplay all the women in America. Not just black women in America, but majority black women in America, but all women in America. You know, the mentality. They're too westernized, liberated, and, you know, too strong and independent over here. Like, it's a whole lot of mess. But... This is what he's teaching and preaching to the men of America. So he has been exposed and <laughs> he is not practicing what he preached. You know what I'm saying? He's treating these so-called exotic women, exoticals, the women overseas, the wives. He's treated them like an average American woman. Um, If you haven't heard, he's got one of them knocked up. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> knocked up and he's going viral right now for trying to make her you know get the abobo you know what i mean trying to make her get the abobo and of course she's refusing to do so but remember these are not westernized women they don't have the mentality of the women over here but for some reason this woman that he knocked up has the mentality of the women over here because she admitted during a calling interview that she doesn't believe in marriage and she doesn't want to get married <laughs> how ironic right and i know this is a clout move because she keeps going on these calling shows and you know trying to expose him even more than what she already did i mean the the text messages alone did all the damage that was needed the recorded phone call was just icing on the cake and we know it was him there's rumors going around that that wasn't him that was ai no ai doesn't stutter all right we know how this fool talk and that was definitely him definitely him so now she's like i said she's doing these call-in shows and everything and she's making herself look way worse than him so in a way she's actually helping him out with his reputation because this woman is slow i am not gonna lie this woman is slow listen to those recorded calling shows that she's on and form your own opinion but this woman is slow i see how he got her i see why he got her because she's slow and i'm thinking that's what these quote-unquote passport bros are all about they going over there to get all the slow women they're trying to get the slow women they don't want the women who who thinks critically uh, who thinks logically or nothing like that they want the slow women because this woman is slow she is really making herself look horrible honestly so uh yeah it's it's just a a a, a, a horrible situation all around i can't listen to her she's supposed to I, honestly I, i'm gonna tell you what i really think about this honestly i think this whole situation is fake now as far as the pregnancy goes all right that part might be real but everything from the from from the text messages i think that was uh pre-planned um not on her part but i think they're both in cahoots together when it comes to the text messages because the stuff that was said would just make me think like nobody talks like this you see what i'm saying but she might but nobody really talks like this and then when it comes to the phone call it was just awkward i'm, I'm thinking i'm listening to the phone call and i'm like this situation <laughs> They don't even sound like they spoke to each other before. Like, how did he pull her? But when I listen to the call-in shows, it's like, oh, okay, she's slow. But she's not that slow. I think she's slow, but <laughs> that sounds horrible. I think she's slow, but smart at the same time. She's smart slow. Slow to just, you know, choose him and from her mentality and all the stuff that, she t that she's saying. But smart because, hey, she she's a, she's an immigrant. 
She found a sucker and she she licked it. That's what she did. So now, is all, all she got to do is drop that baby. Bam, green card. Bam, child support for the next eighteen years because we know she don't want to get married. She she admitted that she don't want to get married. So she found a sucker and she licked. It. That is if this situation is actually true. He's supposed to have her on the show tonight, <laughs> which further led me to believe that. This situation is actually fake and it's like a aha, we got y'all kind of moment, whatever. But if it's not fake, then she's slow. <laughs> That's my thoughts on this situation. But hey, it's all right. It's your boy, Too Clean. I appreciate you guys for watching. Make sure you subscribe to the channel because I'm going to be doing more current event trending topics type of videos now. Um, I'm definitely going to keep doing the hookah videos because that's what y'all come here for initially, right? I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.